Hey guys, we are the cast of Shadowhunters, or part of it. Part. Yes, and we're here to play I Dare You. I Dare You. I, I dare, dare You. You to me. I Dare You. Okay. I Dare You. Let's get started. There. What's the truth? Mix this up. Oh, we nothing but the truth. To tell the truth. Okay. All right. Okay, ready? So ready. What is the most embarrassing nickname you have ever had? Oh, I really want to hear this. Kids are cruel. <laughs> And I've had some nicknames that I wouldn't want to repeat anywhere. I have a 30-year-old friend who in all earnest calls me, calls me da-do-do. I want someone to come up with a nice, solid nickname for me, like something cool. Like, like tall man? You're saved as the godfather <laughs> in my No, like Mr. Electric. You know what? Let's, let's, uh, let's kick it up a notch. Let's do Dare. Ooh. Ooh. Can, can I choose it hand? for you? Sure, I'll let him switch in. We have no control over this. Oh, yes. Let's see. Here we go. Thank okay. you. Attempt a beatbox. No. Okay. I think Harry can actually do this. That no, was no. the problem. I apologize if I spit. <laughs> Very good. Hey, that was a hey. Yes. I do that in the shower every day, every morning. You do, right? <laughs> I'm next. I would like to do a truth, please. Truth, please. Oh. Okay. Tell us the truth. Okay, what is this Oh, that one's, that one's, uh, that's a good one. What's the last thing you searched for on your phone? Yes, Kat. Mm, yes, Kat. Yes, phone. phone is right here. I'm gonna check. I'm gonna verify if it's true. Right, right. The last thing I searched for was Monday Motivation Busy Tumblr. <laughs> because we're having a busy day, and I always do Monday Gotta Motivations the in the Tumblr the edits are pretty. How do you know that to search those terms? Is this something you've searched before? Because every Monday I post a Monday yeah. motivation quote on my Insta story. What is the last one you did? Uh, what my was Monday the last motivation one you did? for today, actually, I can tell you if I look at my story. When you focus on the good, the good gets better. I want to see a dare. All right, come on. Give me a dare. You can. Okay. Okay. Pull a tarot card for the person to your left. Or we have tarot cards right here. Okay. Right, for the person so to your left. So for me. For you. So what are we doing? You're pulling it for the person to yeah. your left. Oh, you pull it. it. Okay. Do I have, am I shuffling? Okay. How does one shuffle tarot cards? This is not a you need to shuffle tarot cards? Okay, ready? <sighs> this one. I know. Well, it doesn't say anything. Do I have to look for it? What's going on? What is it? Four of cups? Oh, was that it? Is that what that is? No, that wasn't it. No, it wasn't it. Cups. This season. Oh, there it is. Oh, wait, wait, you found it. Here we go. The Four of cups. Your own personal motivation. The tree in the picture is a symbol of nature and also of man as a special part of nature. So practical advice is explore your feelings, relax, and allow your spirit to flow. Define your boundaries. It is in deep meditation and in silence that you will find the right words to express your previously mute emotions and experiences. It's gonna sound really weird, but I actually needed to hear that today, so. <laughs> that should be your Monday know, motivation. That should be my Monday motivation. I'm gonna take pictures of this, actually. Explore your feelings, girl. The All right, is he, is he I have to do a dare. Well, I have no idea. Dare. So of course it's going to be something related to singing, which I'm not going to do. It does say, yeah, sing. Text someone else from the Shadowhunters cast. Oh, <gasps> yes, who shall we text? Isaiah? Mm. We text, text Dom or Isaiah? No, I'm going to text, uh, text Alberto. Okay. Text a picture of one of these random Playing, take, take, take I dare you, with Teen Vogue. And say, thinking of you. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. Yes, thinking of you. I was going to say, yes, thinking of you. Baby. Perfect. Thinking of <laughs> you. He's not going to like this. No, he's going to be so confused. Yeah, he might, yeah. Okay. <laughs> there we go. That was a good day. All right, Harry, we're gonna your, see what happens. your call. Uh, let's do a truth since we're mixing it up. All right. If you could be a downworlder, which one would you choose? Um, well, you, you know, are of course, warlocks are the best. Uh, but if I had to choose another one, um, I think I would say werewolf. That's a soft truth. It's a soft truth. It's a truth that does no repercussions. But hey, our fans want to know the truth. No, but here's the thing about werewolves: like they don't need to put salt. They, they, they don't put salt on their food. Werewolf? How do you know? Imagine if werewolves run someone down in the middle of the night and he brings a salt and pepper. Yeah, he's just like <laughs> he's a culinary werewolf. I just think that's uh, that's interesting because I bet their taste everything's heightened. All right, who's up? Oh, it's me. Dare me. Oh. All right, cat. Okay. I'm so nervous. 
Sell a piece of trash to someone in the group. Use your best salesmanship. Okay, Emerald. Yes. So I'm. I saw you start to consume this ring pop, right? I, I yes. took a bite. Yeah. So we're about to leave again in a few minutes, and I really think I have a nice old wrapper that I could sell you. You could wrap around your ring pop to save it for later. You know what? No, thank you. <laughs> oh. oh! Let me paint you a story. Let me paint you okay, a story. Okay, go. You put that in the bottom of your purse. Mm. We've been running around all day. It's been in New York City. There's stuff falling from the sky. Who knows no, what's in the sense, bottom right? of your purse? Right. Yeah. You know? Yeah. There might be little crumbs left over, and if that's just gonna stick. Can I get my wallet, please? Thank you. Four quick truths. Everyone grab one. Just grab one. Have you ever crashed a wedding? No. But I've, I've been to weddings before, <laughs> and it's pretty great. One time you drove a car into a... What That's crashed that? into. Oh. <laughs> Syntax. Come Oops, on. Sorry. Next. Uh, what's the first thing you would do if you were invisible? If I was invisible, I think the first thing I would do is, is like go walk down the street and fix little things. You know, if somebody was about to drop something, I'd try and catch it. Or, you know, just little things like that to make people go, wow, that was cool. How did that happen? Be helpful. Yeah. That's the first thing I'd do. Then I might get creative. Rob a bank. Yeah. Okay, maybe I'll come haunt you A lot you more then. would come back. <laughs> Mine is your biggest irrational fear. Ooh. Do you have one? What's yours? You know the space between the elevator and the, the whatever floor you're standing on? I'm absolutely petrified of dropping things down there. Every time I get into yeah, an elevator, I don't know what it is. It's sh I just, I've always had this like irrational fear. Yeah. I mean, speaking about elevators, I did hear a. St I mean, I don't want to say it because it's so crazy. I don't know. I mean, everything is like really oh, bad. Geez, well, that's a really fearful. Yeah, it's a fear. Yeah, no. I mean, yeah. We'll go with what Cat said. Um, mine. All right. Let's see. It's tell me about your most awkward date. Uh, I I went on a date and I uh, puked during the date. On her? Not on her, but on the the, the dining table. I was what? really sick. I had like 102 degree like fever and and you like puked and, on the table. And, yeah, and I was very sick, but I really wanted to go on this date because uh, I didn't want to miss it because I, I was afraid. It was I was really young and. Um, did I, you guys go on a second date? I, no, we didn't go on a second date at all. So uh, I messed that we up. We still love you. But I'm but glad. But I'm happy now. Happy I'm happy now. married, so it all yeah. worked out. So that was actually a good thing that I puked on. There's I a good one in here of doing your best impression of an animal. You haven't done it. Do, I did a dare. dare. I did a do dare. the best impression of an animal. Okay. What am I going to do? This okay. is my impression okay. of an elephant. Hold on, you have to bear with me here. Okay, this right? is very good. Gotta, oh, no, my that's too small. Okay, Try this it. is the, the trunk. <laughs> It sounds like it sounds like an there, elephant. Is there an elephant around here? That's right. Where's the elephant? Where's the elephant? Hold on. Usually oh it's supposed God. to go inside the coat crate. I'm gonna try it. Okay, ready? Oh, good hey. one. <laughs> Yo, let me see me. <laughs> That's an elephant farting. There you go. Thank you so much, Teen Vogue. We had an amazing time playing I Dare You. Thank you so much. Thank and you. don't forget to check out Shadow Hunters this season. Thank you so much. Bye.